Hi everyone, welcome back to part two of a series about property boundaries and neighbor disputes. In part one, we talked about what encroachment is and what to do to address it. In case you've missed our video, check out the link here. Now let's look at how these conflicts with neighbors can be resolved amicably. I am Lisa Delemi, and I am a title professional working with Federal Standard Abstract. Let's get started. Resolving boundary disputes with your neighbors on your own. The most effective approach is direct communication. Foster a friendly and empathetic atmosphere with the aim of finding common ground. After confirming the existence of an encroachment, initiate dialogue with your neighbor to explore potential solutions. They may not be aware of an issue and be open to resolving it, such as adjusting their fence. Consider selling or negotiating. Selling the portion of land that's encroached upon to your neighbor is a viable option, but it requires careful consideration. This intricate process involves negotiation, legal transfers, survey work, and updates to tax records. It is not a standard solution unless the encroached area is substantial or involves a structure, such as part of your neighbor's garage or building. Mediation as an alternative. If you find yourself at an impasse with your neighbor but wish to avoid legal proceedings, mediation provides an alternative. In this approach, a neutral third party facilitates finding middle ground, which can be the most cost effective compared to resorting to legal action. So that's our video today. I hope you enjoy our series and now have a better understanding of encroachments and boundary disputes. If you have any questions about this topic, please don't hesitate to reach out to Federal Standard Abstract. We are here to assist. Remember to like our video and subscribe to our YouTube channel for the latest in real estate. We'll see you next time.